Oh boy. Time for some minish cap, as it were. Oh fuck. Didn't I get the final element? Please tell me I got the final element. Um... I've accidentally hit a wrong controller setting. I was sitting here like, why is my controller not working? Oh, it didn't work. Oh well. So long, little red-haired child. I think I should be able to talk to What's-His-Face now. Okay, and I think the last place I can go... Hey, can I... Oh. Oh, well, never mind. That was anticlimactic. sucks. Take me to the dead dude's house.
Hell yeah. The one thing I want to look up is... Did I get all the Tiger Scrolls? Yeah. Trying to figure out how to reach the Goron King. I think this is where I need to go, maybe? Well, I got a kinstone piece, that wasn't what I needed, but... Get the last tiger scroll. Oh wow, I can just really have that go forever, huh? Oh, that time it worked. What the fuck? Well, I mean, there ain't nothing for me to buy anyways. I could go to Lake Hylia now, and I can get to that one wall. Actually, how the hell do I get in there?
Whatever, it worked out. God, trying to use the short hop is weird. Imagine if you can combine this with the Pegasus boots. How far you can fucking go. Where the hell does this lead? Oh! Lots of digging. Five point six trillion red ones, but only a few green ones later. Oh, more mysterious shells.
Yeah, boy! Almost there! But it's still just not breaking! This must be that Goron cave I've heard about. We're here to help. Just in the nick of time, all right, everyone together now. Sword beam does not cut grass. What was the point? There's probably a thing to fuse kinstone see on an item that shows up here or something. Nice having all my friends here, but sometimes I can't tell them. six Gorons all here at once, it starts to smell a little ripe. The Goron statue outside the cave is a little scary. These rocks are delicious. I want to stay here forever. Together, there's no rock we can't dig through. Thank goodness, we're finally through. That was a long way to dig. How is it going? It's been a long time since I last visited Hyrule. I hope I can sell lots of kinstones here. Fit perfectly, so that's good. 
Neat. That was a lot of work for a bottle. Oh, that's funny. Okay. Oh, right. That sucked. Trying not to talk. You don't have to try to not talk, dude. You can just talk. I don't really care. Well, I'm making sure that it's not gonna overbear on your, uh, your streaming. <laughs> well, it's fine. I mean, it gives me somebody to talk to. What, Chameleon doesn't talk to you like this? <laughs> no, Chameleon does, but Chameleon's not been around. Oh. <laughs> Chameleon's uh, working full-time now, so he's not around as much as he used to be. Oh. I knew it! Tree. Tree. Snake. The fucking snake! <laughs> no, you're 
you're supposed to look for the colonel, not the you're not looking for snake. <laughs> snake. <laughs> colonel. <laughs> no. <laughs> colonel. <laughs> colonel, I'm trying to sneak around. Hello. Hello? Oh, Walt's in there. I was what? Like... Maybe something good will happen. The fucking Hyrule Castle explodes. Oh, look, he found all the half. the half a. the half a. <laughs> the half a what? The half a green ones. Yeah. <laughs> Did you have fun finding those? No. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Just go into Hyrule Castle exactly like this. You can't. There's... Oh. Oh, they're all gone. All the guards and shit, they're gone. Oh, duh. The king probably summoned them. The king has murdered them. Me body. That's the king is no longer there. <laughs> King Vati. Well, you're not gonna go to the woods? So you just open. No, I'm good. Even if I go there, there's nothing there. Yeah, you just opened the thing. I mean, I opened the thing, but there was nothing there. Look, there's a guard. <laughs> <laughs> I like how he doesn't even notice. Then the maze changes. Do you imagine that shit? <laughs> Every single time. The maze. Every single. Yeah, did you know that the Knights of Hyrule also double as gardeners? <laughs> well, I wonder what that, what that spear is for. <laughs> is, it for is it a new rake? Yes, yes, it's a new rake. Yes, my favorite rake. Thanks. Why did that? You know what? Fuck it. Why are you arguing with games logic? <laughs> because I have fault with it. I don't. Do it. Wind. It doesn't look like wind. You'd think that the purple one would be more like the a The sparkly, fire. shiny sword! The purple one is the fire one. Fire. <laughs> yeah, purple is fire. Well, if they made that one, the, that one red, it would look a lot more like a fire. But no. It's like a... <laughs> I can't say things like that. Oh, what's happening? What, why'd you do that for? Hey. I'm gonna go in there, and then it's just gonna be like, Haha, you fool! You've opened the doorway for me, Vati! You did. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> He's already in there. What? How'd you get- I don't know. Ah, oh, yes, the panel. A long, 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 long time ago, when the world was on the verge of being swallowed by shadow, by several keys, a single moblin, and a couple <laughs> octoroks, the tiny Picori appeared from the sky, bearing, bringing the hero of man a sword and a golden light. With the wisdom and courage, uh, the hero drove out the darkness. I like how he's stepping on an octa rock. When peace had been restored, the people enshrined that blade with care. The force of the golden light embodied Hyrule's princess, shone forth upon the land. <laughs> so that's what it means. As though you really are too kind. 
First you give me my magic cap, and then you guide me here. You've been far too generous, but now I no longer have any use for you. <laughs> At last I found the location of the Light Force. I don't even get, like, Vati is like a crap tier villain. It feels like he's evil just for the sake of being evil. Disguised himself as the king to search for the Light Force. When he learned of this place, he waited for us to reforge the blade. If that stained glass is accurate, Princess Zelda holds the Light Force. Vati will do whatever it takes to steal the power from her. And if he succeeds, we may not ever be able to return the princess to normal. We've wasted too much time. Sounds like your fault, not mine. How did he even get in here? The fucking door locked behind me. He's a sorcerer. How do you think? Oh yeah, I forgot that doors don't exist for sorcerers. Well, if he just walked in here, it's, he can do whatever he wants. Ah yes, I <laughs> created the legendary blade that does not call. It's not called the Master Sword. <laughs> Behold, the legendary blade. Ah, yes, the Master Sword. No, the other one. The Four Sword? Yes. No, the other blade. one. Phantom Hour so Phantom Sword. No, no, the other one. Well, actually, it's what the, is this? The one you actually built is the Four Sword. Yeah. <laughs> the guards and Zelda. Oh, no. <laughs> the power of the Four Sword. <laughs> <laughs> Door's locked. Oh, no. Door locked. Do I, do I have to destroy? How the hell do I get out of here? You must push him out of the way. Ah, oh, push it. No, seriously, how do I get out of here? Did you try doing anything else? That's not gonna work. what do I do? <laughs> What? Why are you asking me what to do? Now is the time to use the true power of the four sword. Use the sword. Thanks. The sword. Yeah, I, I did. Sl the full power of the sword. Charge up the sword. <laughs> Charge it. Oh. Do you think? Oh. Yeah. We need your help, Jesus Christ. <laughs> he took our petrified princess. He must be planning something fiendish. You must stop him. Well, old man, you better figure out how to get us out of here. <laughs> that card's not moving. I wonder what he'll say if I just leave this dude. I want to see. You can't leave him together. To every single one of them. Oh my god. That would have been funny. Let's leave this guy totally petrified. You just can. <laughs> it would be funny if you could just leave him there. Dark Hyrule Castle. Yes. Obviously. Oh, cool, now it's a dungeon. Good thing you don't know how, do you know how to get through the whole map. Ooh, I'm sorry, what was that? The map. Do you want to run that by me again? The door? Fucking trap doors and shit. <laughs> Thank you, buddy, for the for the trap door. <laughs> it wasn't in the original Hyrule Castle. Why would it be in this one? <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> I 
Sometimes you're supposed to get rid of the thing. When you... Try. But he's just kind of like, nah, I don't really feel like it. <laughs> Why would you bomb it? Oh. Let's see, that bomb's not gonna work. Ah, yes. Thing. Excuse me, just gotta go down the stairs. Nope. <laughs> Excuse me, let's go use this. Well, let's use this trap door really quick. <laughs> yeah, right? It's like fucking. <laughs> the doors are just sort of like, oh yes, hello. Which one of us is a trap? Wouldn't you like to know? I would. I actually would like to know. <laughs> oh, here's this magic item that. <laughs> That tells you exactly which uh, which doors are fake. What the hell? <laughs> Ow. Okay, so I don't actually need to come down. I, actually, what was the point of coming this way? Um, for the fun of it? I, I guess. <laughs> you need to find the key. There a key even around here? Eventually you gotta find the key. Oh, like a door. Like a hole. It's just, you know, it says yeah. a hole right there, right? What, you mean the one where the fire pit yeah, is? Yeah, did you notice it goes right downstairs? Yeah. <laughs> That's why it is downstairs. So you can get back up here. It doesn't look like there's anything to do here. Fuck, this shit lasts forever, don't it? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Why are those? Why are the skeletons one? Two of them are blue and one's red. They have different attack patterns. Why? That makes no sense. That's no point. It's a two-person. <laughs> I know, but it makes me do the the four-person. Like I can't just do two-person anymore. Yes, you can. I tried to. It wouldn't let me. You had to go out the door. Ah uh, yes. F fairies, really? I guess. Oh yeah, I need those arrows as well. Scoop. For some, I thought you were gonna use the dumb thing to scoop the arrows into the bear into the bottle. What the hell? No! <laughs> what? The Why? I didn't mean to. Yes, you did. I know you did. Yoinks! That looks like the boss key. <laughs> Can't go that way. Can't go the other way either. And it's like, where, where do I go? <laughs> Up. What am I doing? Huh. Through the trap door. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you love how that rock reset? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> hey. Wait a minute. <laughs> God damn it. This shit again. Fine, let's go into the pit, I guess. I don't know. Like, I don't remember how, how I beat this before. Remember, I, I haven't played... The... I'm not asking. I, I fucking... I just don't know where to go. Something tells me I'm supposed to reach the king over there, but I have no idea how. Unless... I might have an idea. Okay. I'm waiting for your idea. So... Numero uno, I go in here. 
I shrink. <laughs> and I go into the pit. That sounds familiar. That sounds right. Oh, I don't know why I read my own fucking box as like. This makes perfect sense. Ah, uh, yes, I want to be in this jail cell. <laughs> the doors are open, both of them, from inside of one of the cells. Why? Don't ask. Why is this? <laughs> why are we? How, how am I? Our uh, person's getting escaping anyway. Oh, it's very obvious. Uh, there's a switch that opens both gates. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> exactly one of the prison gate prisons. What? <laughs> You're the one who uh, broke the curse and returned me to normal. You've grown quite brave since I last saw you. Oh, but now, um, but now the castle's fallen into the hands of Vati. Oh shit! Is this all the work of one man? As the king of Hyrule, I must do something about this villain. Would you like to fuse skin stones? <laughs> But, uh, I'm old and I would only hold you back. You have the Sacred Blade now, and we must rely on you. Please, find a way to rescue Zelda. Take this key. You could use it to get out from the castle basement. Yeah, look, a key. Ezra, I think you needed that. <laughs> Perhaps. Oh, um, I thought you were gonna say, "Oh, we need to fuse the kinstones." Not now. I know. I need to use it on this door. Whoops! <laughs> it just opens the door. What? <laughs> I mean, it just opens it. Like what? Does it make sense? Yeah. See, even if I want to, it makes me do the floor now. Not that real fake doors. Where does this go? Outside? How does this work? Ah, oh, yes, the wizard robes. Everybody loves Moldorm. Yeah, including Nizro. Nizro loves those things. He's stuck in a, in a corner. <laughs> Nizro, he's got a slash at it. Wow! Moldorm wants to fuse kinstone pieces! He does, look. He just dropped one. <laughs> Dungeon map! The map? Oh, who needs a map? You already know where you're going. At this turn, at, at the crossroads, use the left fork. Okay. Uh, look, it's the way outside. <laughs> at the next light, take a fright! That's where there's the way outside. Why wouldn't you go outside? Outdoors! Oh boy! <laughs> the outdoors is actually a trap. Wow, it actually did just take me outside, didn't it? <laughs> it's a trap door. What? <laughs> it's actually a trap door. What? That that feels like something that would be like very fitting for a place like this. Oh boy, I get to go outside. No. <laughs> Yet. You have to beat the candle. Oh I don't wanna. Well, yeah, he probably let you go outside in case you had anything else you wanted to do outside. Like confuse more kinstone pieces. Yeah, I can't wait. Mark. Or find more figurines. Fuck that. <laughs> oh, yes, the cans. Good luck. I win!
Did you win? No. Look, like a floor master. Now, where's the wall master? <laughs> I think those are wall masters, not floor masters, floor but they're styled like like floor masters. Oh, because the floor for the wall master comes from the ceiling and falls down. Oh, I get it. Nizzer, how are you supposed to get back? If you hit the button, how would you open? Oh. Oh boy, Keith wants to fuse Kinstone pieces. I think that was the uh, the moblin who dropped that. Was it? I can't even tell anymore. It was a moblin. Oh, good! It's another one of these. Well, these are fun. Oh, right. I only get to hear what happens after one. It's because it's a little delayed. Ah, uh, Yeah, it's like... Well, I mean, there has to be. For... No, I... Capture, I... On stream, because I'm watching the stream at the same time. So you say, oh darn, and I look over like, what? <laughs> ah, fuck! And then it's shaped like a swastika for some reason. What? God damn it. Can I... Where's the fairy powder to turn this into a fairy? <laughs> the magic powder. There's no magic card that does that. Not even any game I've played so far does that. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Another key. I wonder where that one goes to. Yoink. Oh, I'm sitting here like waiting for it to load and I'm just like, why isn't it loading? I had to take like a half step forward. Why won't this door load? Hmm, perhaps it would help if I stood in it. So wait, you actually paid for the actual other boomerang before you bought the, got the new one? Yeah. Why? Because I didn't realize that there was going to be a magic boomerang. If, it was, if I knew that there was, I wouldn't have bought this one. I told you not to buy it! You told me not to buy it, you didn't explain why. I thought it was very obvious. No. <laughs> um, okay, the cannons are faced like that, so you might want to hit the oh lord, I know how you do how to do it. I forgot about this. One, two, three, four. Oh yeah, I think I get this. I need two on one side, two on the other. <laughs> They have to fa they have to be able to hit them all at once. Yeah, I know. I tried spin attacking, thinking that would be good. Nope. Isn't this great, Nazrael? <laughs> nope. Oh, that's wrong. Try to figure it out. Okay. Yeah, we're, we were close to the first point.
fuck? It's not gonna work the way you want it to, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm figuring it out. Give me a second okay. here. There we go. Oh! Hopefully you memorize how to beat every single boss, every uh, enemy so far. <laughs> it's just like in any um, tower, it's like like Gen's tower in the game. <laughs> you, they have all the enemies in each. <laughs> what? What is the point? The point of having the oh, because it's funny. Also, the, what, is the wall not bombable? Didn't seem like that was the answer. Israel, <laughs> try the left one. The left one. Yeah, that is the left one. Yeah, it's the left one. Oh, whoever invented these things die. Oh, the fire bars? Yeah. Uh, that'd be Mario. Mario games that did that. Yay! The Dark Nut! <laughs> yeah, he's got elemental attacks. Yay! He also switches handedness, if you didn't know, based on his sprite. Uh-huh. Weird. Uh, I did it. Interesting. Okay, good to know. What, the chair? Vibrated. Yeah, there's... A compass! Compass? Sentence. Complicated ass. Yes, that, that, that sounds about right. Oh yeah, by the way, did you figure out your uh, your little problem from before? <laughs> your uh, how you get to the Goron Tunnel? Yeah, it was it was weird. It was like an angle thing that I was doing wrong. It wasn't that an angle thing. I told you that you had to go find another Kinstone piece. No, you didn't. You just had to do it at a certain angle. No, it was a Kinstone piece. Yeah, I did the Kinstone piece thing. The tornado was there. Yeah. I was in the tornado. The tornado didn't move, you just had to like angle it a certain way. It was weird. Oh, look, Mulder wanted to use kinstones. <laughs> oh boy, more kinstones to fuse. Well, there is a few places you still haven't gone. Fine. I'm not going to do them. What? Yeah, you have to go that way. Okay. <laughs> That's a puzzle. <laughs> have fun. <laughs> that one does shoot arrows if you haven't noticed. I saw.
Oh boy, Mobley wanted to fuse Kingstone pieces. Hey, they're also dropping the green ones too, which is hilarious. <laughs> yeah, the ones that I didn't have access to. God knows how long. <laughs> that looks very odd uh, there. <laughs> Almost as if you need to use the ball. <laughs> Oh, what? 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 They're all you. Yeah, I get that, but it's like fucking <laughs> the far outer one gets like tapped once and it's just sort of like, God has abandoned me. I'm now on fire. <laughs> and then he ran, ran him into, into a rock. <laughs> yeah, fucking he deserves it. <laughs> Screw you and that rock. <laughs> Country fried Christ crackers. Thanks! Oh, the exit has been blocked. <laughs> Damn, that's crazy. I wonder where that door went. <laughs> why? Why would I don't think I was supposed to. No, I don't think I was perhaps supposed to land there. No, you're supposed to keep going around it. <laughs> this doesn't make sense for why Ezlo can do this. Makes no sense. I like his doofy little face when he flies. <laughs> but you're holding him. That's his face. Yeah, um, I understand where you're holding him from. Dick. Probably. <laughs> Link, you're holding me by my own man balls. It fucking hurts. Well, he's, he's probably, he's probably, you're a child, by, this, by the way. You're a child holding up an older man. <laughs> now grab your destiny, if you know what I mean. That's right, there's a door over there that you passed by that you could have gone in. I know. Uh, I think you need a lot more hearts. Perhaps. You need also get Slap! Yeah, you get the heart stars and the horseshoes. Clovers and balloons! <laughs> well, you already have the balloon. That's low. Hourglass, it's rainbows! No, the Phantom Hourglass is not here. <laughs> hourglasses? No, 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 we're done with this. <laughs> yeah. The phantom hourglasses at that. Yeah, see, even if I go in here, I can't do anything. It could have. Maybe. Well, actually, can I can I push this? Oh. Yeah, I'm sitting here like, oh, don't tell me. I gotta shoot that switch again. That'd be kind of annoying. Yes, you do. What are you complaining about? You get 90 freaking arrows. You can... oh. 70. Sometimes it's that you need those things again. <laughs> oh lord! The buttons have to be pressed in a specific way. I did it! Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> this the... Why? Why would you do this the, the hard way? Whoops. Did you try using the big bombos? Oh. Also, it's kind of funny, apparently, uh, just throwing these at them will damage them.
Money! Yeah, that's a big... That's a big one. Oh, it's probably because it's a yellow enemy. Huh? <laughs> Those stupid yellow enemies. Hey, hey! I know where that goes. Where the, f where the fuck am I? You're in the castle, obviously. Interesting, interesting. Okay, good to know. Fucking what? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> so did you not figure out you have to use those bomb guys? <laughs> you could. That, that... <laughs> I hit a, I hit a switch. Yeah, did it. The other one. But yeah, but how are you gonna get through the hole? Natural, why would you do that that way? I don't know, man. Help! Oh wait, I get it. <laughs> you. Took me a second. <laughs> I get it. Did you figure it I, out? I understand. Yoink! <laughs> Ow! Get <Jet> it! <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while since the game had me use it. Okay, I had to think. <laughs> Poof! Ah! And then... ah! <laughs> I like how I was very clearly on the great, um, and the game was just sort of like, no, you're through it. The door shut on you. That's really why I should open the door again. Perhaps. Or. Ah, yes, the anti Mmm! That doesn't look good! Oh, yes, the black dark nut. Yes! You had enough trouble with the yellow one. Sorry, red one. <laughs> that does, that's a lot of damage. I'm dead! Yeah, only four hearts. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, fairy, for giving me only four hearts. God, this thing is kicking my ass. Yeah, you kind of probably want it, want more of those fairies later. And when he does the thing. Tornado attack. I did it! <laughs> Why did he spawn? Why did they spawn? What is going on? Oh! Because you need to beat them all so you can get past the doors. What is the point of going past the doors? Um, it's important. Why? Oh, God. Really? Yeah. See, it's important. <laughs> Please, more healies. Let's go back down to the base to the first to the basement floor. We found the thing <laughs> berries. <laughs> As we go to the basement, you'll have more floor. I don't need more fairies, I just need more healing. Well, you go to the Whatever. fairies, you find more heals. Take me! Fairies give you full health on <laughs> all the first one you grab! <laughs> find basement. How did you get to basement door? <laughs> Christ alive. 
Moldor! Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of weird that they give you full health when you first grab them, but not when you, like, are dying, you know? Well, what? That'd be too easy. That's what you had to break it first. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, God, hang on. <laughs> I don't know why you try. <laughs> Like, no, don't get, don't stay in the freaking bottle, you. <laughs> Stan! <laughs> See? Cool, now you got more fairies. Which, by the way, you will probably need them again later. Probably. Where are you going? Oh, more, more uh, I'm just topping off on my other stuff. Figured as long as I'm here. You're free, little fairy. Okay, I'm maxed out. Are you, though? I mean, to me, it seems like it. Did you max out on, on your Kingstone Peak? Ah! Uh... Did you max out on the Kingstone Pieces? Yes. Okay. <laughs> you got 900. There are no more Kingstone Pieces. Yeah, there are no more kinstone pieces. They're all dead. Yeah, so where are you going? Get wrong way. Go, go to the elevator. Get up the elevator. The teleporter. Elevator! It's like an elevator. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I forgot those good old fashioned walking elevators. God damn it. Fucking wizard robes. Bane of my goddamn existence. Could be. The bane of Nestor's existence is actually Fee. God. Uh, don't make me think of her. <laughs> worst fucking Zelda character. No, according to you, there was a, there was a worse one than that now. <laughs> I, I can't even remember who that is. No. Ah, my rupees! Oh, that's fine. I'll just go pick up, pick them all up again. Yeah. When I was warning about the the red uh, crows, that's exactly what they do. They steal all your rupees. <laughs> they steal your rupees. And then just leave. I'm like, are you kidding me? You. Suck. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. Why didn't you take the elevator? An elevator! There's no Tele fucking the elevator! teleporter! Oh. I don't know. You're taking the long way! Alright. <laughs> you're doing the extra work that you don't need to do! Yeah, I guess you're, I guess you're right, aren't you? No? Maybe? <laughs> no. <laughs> Hello, King. Hello, hi, old King. How are you doing here? Wait a minute. You're in the dress I up, am. So. <laughs> Shut up. What? No, I'm talking to the fucking the Moldorm. Okay, fuck this. I'm going back. <laughs> yeah, go, go, go. I thought I was much closer than I actually was. No. Remember, take the red, red elevator, teleporter thing. Yeah, I thought it would. Yeah, okay, whatever. <laughs> Red elevator slash teleporter. Not the blue one. The blue one goes back to another boss that you already beat. Well, the, the throne room. I think. That has abandoned oh, that me. That wasn't the throne room. Where's the blue? Who cares? Something. Ah! You want to know what the actual worst part about those is? Is that even once they burn you and you get to the edge and it, you're just like, okay, cool, I can just leave. The thing's just sort of like, no. Nah. <laughs> no. <Nah. laughs> oh, I was going to say, where are you going? 
That's ironically still, I think, a shorter route. <laughs> yeah, at least that way I can top off. <laughs> mm. Passing on through. Excuse me, Wizrobes. Fuck off. Dead. Okay, now you just gotta find all the, the the bad guys. Now all I gotta do is fight them all. Find them all. You know. The red ones, oh the white ones. The... How the fuck do I beat these guys easily? Green. Oh, good. Have you ever learned how to beat a Dark Knight? Not in this game! No. That's one. Now I gotta get the other one. Hey, he dropped a kinstone piece. Yeah, Darknet wants to. <laughs> Did you beat the, all of them yet? Ah, yes, this. Yeah. <laughs> ah, yes, another one of these puzzles. Great. No, you have to turn it green. Ah, yes, the ghosts. I only had to kill one of them, which was kind of weird. You had to kill the real one. The actual fake ones. Are they fake? No. Ah, yes, the, the thief wanted to, st to give you a few skins on pizzas, obviously. Yeah. Can't wait. Hmm. A storage depot. Yeah. Except for that one doesn't have fairies. Oh boy, what's in here? Oh, it's a small key. I was sitting. I I wouldn't surprise me if like I opened one of these chests at the very end, it would, and it was like one of those Zelda mimic chests that just fucking lights you on fire, or freezes you, or some shit. <laughs> oh, it's a trap door, obviously. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> It's a trapdoor, you open it up and it says, My name's Alpha or what's his name? Uh Astolfo. Astolfo. <laughs> ah yes, the bombs. Hello, red red boy. I win! But did he drop a, a big key? That! That's a wall master. That is a dick move. Wall master. <laughs> See? Those are the wall masters. Yeah. <laughs> There's a difference between a floor master and a wall master. Thought you would have known this since you did play with Wicker. <laughs> yeah, well, what is it? 
Wind Waker didn't have uh Floor Master, yeah, it did. No, it had Floor Masters, it didn't have Wall Masters. Yeah, it did. No, it didn't. Arrows. I, I am aware. Well, you, I said use a boomerang. <laughs> you hit the eyeball, but what at what cost? <laughs> uh... <laughs> Whatever. It's fine. <laughs> God, this thing is... Fire bar from Mario, yes. There we go, that's the wrong a wrong answer. <laughs> Why? Give dough. Yay. Am I going, you may ask? The answer is I don't know. <laughs> right there. <laughs> you gotta hit the button. Where the hell does this lead? Up. The sure is a place. Where's that up go? I don't know, where does the up dog go? I, I'm not where is it out. Treasure. Oh, it's probably another key. <laughs> oh boy, where's the wall master? Oh, that, those just give hearts. Yeah, hang on one sec. Hmm. Beastie. Why again? Why are you playing as the bad guy in this game again? I don't know, cause I feel like it. Everybody knows the Link's always the bad guy in every game. Yeah, he undermines uh, hardworking racial ethnicities by denying their overtaking of corporate businesses and such things. No. Sorry, man from the desert. No Hyrule Kingdom for you. God is dead. Fire bars. Gee. <laughs> How is the fire bar not providing even the smallest amount of light? It's, it's not it's supposed to be hard. <laughs> fire goes out. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Jesus. Something like wrist robes. Where's the real one? Dang it. I don't know. Where am I going? Treasure chest! Treasure. Something tells me this might be a mimic. Perhaps. <laughs> Dark Souls has trained me in every single hunt. <laughs> yeah, why can't I do chest checks to make sure they aren't mimics? You can. You haven't tried it once. Woo! <laughs> Why? I win! Oh, good. Good! <laughs> Your favorite thing in the world, fire bars. Nope. There we go. 
No, that's not how it's supposed to be. <laughs> that probably looked incredibly confusing from the perspective of chat. But I spun a tag there, so instead it just looked like I glitched the fuck out of the game. Hi! Push robes. Yay! Fuck off. Fucking wizard robe. Button. <laughs> well, I wanna go down the stairs. Yeah, we got it! Yeah, last key! Yeah, we only can use one key at a time, which is hilarious. Oh, how the fuck do I get out of here fast? The stairs. Right out here, just use a hole. Hmm. Yeah, look, give those. <laughs> what? I want to see what's in the room. Gibdos are what's in the room. Oh, there's got something else in the room with the Gibdos. Is that, why would they only be in that room? Only one thing in that room. <laughs> Doesn't make sense. They have to be guarding something. No, believe it or not, it's just Gibdos, and I'm taking damage now, so I could go find that out. Oh. Is it really just the Gibdos? Yes, it's really just the Gibdos. I took damage for that. Oh. Now I no longer have Sword Beam. You don't need a Sword Beam. Sword Beam is good. Yeah. It's a staple. It's, yes, it it's a thing that's in every single Zelda game. Sword Beam is good. Yes. Let's use the key. I cannot. I have to go recover the key. So why don't we just do it all at once? What? Well, you, could just, you could have just done all those at once, all the locks at once. Because I crave inefficiency. I noticed. Push it the wrong way. <laughs> no, that's the right way. Why would you push it the right way? Because... Push it the wrong way. No, to spite you. Screw, screw you. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! But that's right, you're now down, you're low on fairies. I, I don't think I am. Where's your fifth fairy? You are persistent, aren't you? So you've come to stop my little ceremony. Well, you're too late. A mere three more chimes of the bell will bring the ceremony to an end, and with the third toll of the bell, I will become like a god. Your precious Zelda will be nothing more than a cold, dead stone. Excuse me? Oh, darn, the bell rang. By the way, I have no game sound since I turned off the stream. <laughs> yeah! They want to fuse kinstones. I I don't think they do, believe it or not.
Just a few more moments and the ceremony would have been complete. You really are obsessed with stopping me, aren't you? Ah, oh, very well. I have not yet drained all of the Light Force housed in Princess Zelda. But what I have should suffice. I shall be transformed. Unstoppable! But first, let me attend to the pesky worms that would trifle with me. Hmph! I'll have no more of you interfering with my plans. Let me show you my true power. He's become a triangle. Hmm, interesting. Ow. Firebar. What is happening? What is... what is... what am I supposed to do here? Kill the things... Circling. I... I... am I? Ah, damn, son. Calm down. Why? How do I avoid that? Oh cool, I'm gonna die because... I, I swear to god, fire is hands down the worst effect of this game. This is pretty bad too. Oh my god, dude. I fucking can't stand some of this shit. I, I do not understand. Love it. I do not understand what the game wants from me. Use the gust jar. Really? Yeah. Really? It's armored. They're armored. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I wanted to see how, if you, how many times you would try this. I, I thought it was something to do with, logically, I thought it was something to do with the curse or whatever. You know, like, oh, you got a sacred sword then. 
please. I, I really, I really do just hate the way that they've handled fire in this game. By, by the way, this, uh, this is only the first phase. Yeah, I know, and I'm already in a shit position. Well, you seem to have some fight in you, I commend your bravery. But you will not survive this! <laughs> I am filled with a power that you cannot begin to understand. Do you think that your beauty sword will save you from me? Certain ones they are. Can I attack his eyes just like this? Unless I gotta attack them all yes, at once don't. to get them to, okay. Can you piss off for like five seconds? The sword takes five hours to charge up with energy. The sad part is it doesn't even feel like I'm fucking around when I ask for that. Oh, cool. Game over! 
Dark Hyrule Castle. Oh, cool. I'm at no health. No fairies. Of course. That could be that nice. Let me guess, I gotta do that whole stupid three bells gauntlet again. Yep. That sucks. give this game props if it doesn't make me do the gauntlets again. If it makes me do the gauntlet again, that's just gonna be tedious and a bit annoying. Have you played four swords before? Um, I think I might have tried. I've played a little, but I don't recall finishing it. Oh my god! I thought so. Stone pieces. Oh my god, why would you put so many of these in a single room?
Monologue, 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 I'm evil. Why am I evil? You'll never know why I'm evil. I'm just evil. Go down this hole. Why don't you just roll? <laughs> roll away from it. <laughs> Time to show you my true power. Behold, now I am tall. This is the worst. This is the first phase. God. Yeah, and the first phase is fucking hard mode compared to like the second phase. Second plate the phase was like fucking clown college of easy. Compared to that, at least fucking phase two doesn't spit out these annoying ass fireballs that make me waste five hours of my life running around. Seriously, fire is the worst effect of this game, dude. Oh my god, I've just about McFucking had it. It's, it's, I know how hard it is. I've beaten it. I have beaten this game. It took me at least a th few raid quits before I gave up. Before I actually gave up anything, sorry. Like, before you gave up. I was like, wait, I can. Yeah, I was like, wait a minute. That's not right. <laughs> Honestly, the only thing that's, like, frustrating about this boss fight is this! This! The fucking fireballs, dude! Seriously, whoever designed those, please reconsider. Uh, they can't really reconsider. They already made the game. Yeah, okay, just kill me. That's... There's... So many little things, dude. And this! Oh my god. Fucking stop, please. Stop, dude! Oh my god.
Oh my god. <laughs> Behold, I have become the biggest clown of them all. I've gone straight from looking like one and now I'm the big fucking nose. There's another phase past yep. this. Three. Hello, healing? I'm taking more damage from trying to get these off one up than I am from. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna even bother trying to find hearts in those. I I'm, I'm taking more damage than I should have from Ed.
What is this madness? I have the power of a god. I have unstoppable might. How could I lose to a child? Healies, please. What? You should have gone to the next, next page. Now that you have the power of the Four Sword, you must return Princess Zelda to normal. Thank you so much for- oh, I hit a button that I shouldn't have. Uh, one second. Thank you so much for saving me. When I was turned into stone, I saw visions of you, as if in a dream. Yeah. It looks like the curse has been broken. I'm glad we made it in time. <laughs> the castle's collapsing! It's too dangerous here. Quickly! We must escape from the castle. The door is blocked. We have no choice. Head back to the sanctuary. Oh, cool. Thank you for just leaving this open. Obviously. I, I don't know, man. They blocked off all the other paths, so I wasn't expecting. Nice route. Go back for more. I am. <laughs> Sorry, Zelda. If you ask me why I'm doing this, the answer is because this game is full of clowns. Nice did you save? I'm about to. One second. This fairy that is floating in the ether. I like how she was blinking at that exact moment, so it looked like she's just sort of like, Ugh, goddammit, Link and his weird-ass fairy catching. Zelda is not amused. <laughs> like, Ugh, my friend is a clown. Oh my god, he just keeps going for fairies and then holding it above his head. You will not escape, boy. Now you will see the true power of the Light Force, for I have become Vati, the master of this world. No, you haven't. He's a big eye with hands. Not just a third phase. <laughs> Judging by the look in your eyes, I see you made up your mind. Excellent. Perhaps now we're ready to face Vati. Mmm. Great. That was a hit. Didn't seem like didn't seem like arrows was the answer either. I keep on getting bounced off the cliff. Being mini didn't seem to help me at all. Let me know when you want my help. 
Um, what other items do I have? Boomerang! Pegasus! Have access to Minish Land. It's the staff? Are you kidding me? That's so fucking weird. Oh, cool. What is... Oh, arrows. I'm gonna guess. Or not? A rod? Weird. I couldn't kill even one of them. It's the only one you can kill. Mati, can you piss off away from this? I see it. They're small. Just like the eyes I'm supposed to. I think I get it.
Dead. Okay. Well, not dead, but I don't think I got too many chances left. Pretty much the fight. Oh, God. Currently doing my best to not die. God. Oh, I put the life force of my power. I had such power. So wait, you finished the grind quest, right? Yeah, I got the bottle from that. Back Thank there. goodness you're safe. Huh? I want to go back there. The game's what you're doing. This is. Yeah, why's that? Uh, there's another Goron you missed. Another Goron I missed? I got all six of them, though. There's a seventh one. One with the just heart wears the cap. Things can be made right again. Your wishes be known. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, it looks really si <laughs> really silly.
of the people who have been uh, returned from being stoned, and they're all back to normal. The head is breaking apart. It's overflowing with the power of life. The head has the power to turn the thoughts of the wearer into reality. Vati's heart was filled with evil, and that was reflected of what he became. But it seems that Zelda's pure heart, coupled with the hat's power, has created a miracle. Hmm, it looks like the time for us to part has come. The Minish door opens but once in a hundred years, and it will soon close. I must return to my homeland soon. I know I've caused you must suffer, much suffering. But the evil one's power has withered, and the power of Princess Zelda herself has restored the light to Hyrule. Well, Nezero, my journey with you was exciting, to say the least. In fact, I'm more than just a little sad that we must part ways now. Please accept this. You know, I've never actually seen you wearing a cap until now. Suits you, little hero. Take care. Farewell, my friend. Congratulations! Okay, I'm gonna give my final thoughts on this game. Not bad. Uh, that is to say, it's not the best... Uh, how to say this? I'm not going to say not the best Zelda, because I then I have to hold the 3D Zeldas as a standard as part of that, which is a little too difficult, but when I compare it to the experience that I have with a lot of the top-down kind of Zeldas, um, I think of, like, Spirit Tracks, I think of Wind... Or I think of Spirit Tracks, I think of Phantom Hourglass, I think of... I think I did a link to the past. I might be mistaken. I know I did a link between worlds. I'm pretty sure I did a link between worlds. I haven't done a link to the past. Um, this one isn't bad. Um, it is short. Um, that's not necessarily a bad thing, but it is short. Um, the overall game itself was not a bad experience. Um... Ezlo is actually not a bad partner character. Is he useful? No. Does he exist? Yeah. Um. I would say, like, but but I would argue, like, in terms of, like, usefulness, he's actually probably the least useful um, partner character. Like, every partner character typically serves as some form of representation of mechanic within the game, so, like, Minna pulls you into the twilight, you know, Navi is your Z target, um, things like that. Ezel really just transforms you, and he gives you, like, maybe at best little reminders of what direction you're supposed to be heading, and other times it's just completely and totally useless. Um. Vati, which we can see here, is a low-tier villain. Even among Zelda villains, I felt like his goals were very ambiguous outside of I want the life force well why do you want the life force because I am evil and I desire it um it was a game with a lot of personality but it did have its problems um in particularly the kinstone fusing thing got to be tedious in the same way that getting items in Skyward Sword, the original version, was tedious because you would get a pop-up every single time. It's like, yes, I understand. It's a green kinstone. I confuse it with other green kinstones. Um, I, I got that, you know what I mean? But, like, after a while... Does my quest to come to an end? Yep. Surely this is not the end of Zelda and Nezero's adventures in Hyrule. Legend will continue. As long as the power of the Light Force echoes throughout the ages. Um. Alright, yep, yep, yep.
save. Um, finishing up my thoughts. I, I'm I want to organize it. Things that this game did well. Um, good world. Um, lots of fun dungeons. Um, and the Kinstone system, while tedious, was not bad. Um, it was very interesting to go out into the world and experience the things that you unlocked from a distance it, it could have been streamlined a little bit streamlining stuff like that is something that you can really only do retroactively um let's see here things that it could have done better um Vati is kind of a crap villain but i mean he's no more crap villain than some of the other crap villains that zelda has had um that being said his boss fight did suck um, it wasn't even hard, it just sucked to do. Um, I said it before, but the fire effect in this game is actually hot trash. Um, because when you get lit on fire, you start running around and all that other shit. And there's no way for you to put it out except to wait it out. But because you're running around, the best you can do is hold yourself into a corner until the time runs out. Um... If you could, like, roll to put it out, that would have been much better. But they didn't include something like that. Which was strange to me, because that was the first place my brain went when I first got lit on fire. Was, oh yeah, stop, drop, and roll. I should obviously roll now to put out the fire, because I don't like this effect. And the game was like, nope, sorry, can't roll, can't draw your weapon, can't do anything while you're on fire. You just gotta wait it out. And that, that was, that was kind of miserable. Um... That, that is probably, ironically, my biggest complaint about this game, is the fire. Um, the fire was a miserable effect to, to deal with, and it showed up a lot. Um, but other than that... Other than that, um, I would say, like, the other little thing that I would maybe say is... If you don't do the kinstone things the world is very small um that is to say if you wanted to focus primarily on the main quest you become very quickly aware of how small this world is world is it's like um a lot of things cramped into a small place um but every place kind of serves its one purpose and then it's done you know, logically. Um, once, unless you're going back to... Unless you're going back to certain places for kinstone fusions and like, there's not really much of a point um, to going back there. Outside of that, I can't really think of any big criticisms. Um... Other than it is very short. Overall, I would give it a B- rating. Um, with its glaring issues being its shortness, how clunky the kinstone system can feel sometimes when you're dealing with kinstones in the field, the fire effects, and how small and empty the world feels if you choose not to participate in the optional kinstone thing. Which is optional for all of, like, most of the game with the exception of, like, four occurrences, I believe. Um, actually, no, it's, uh, technically, technically five. Technically, if you wanted to whittle it down more, it's, like, three, because you do it, you do it once in the swamp, you do it once in, for the waterfall, and then you do it once in the sky, and those are the three times you really have to do it. Um, outside of that, the Kinsub system, which felt like it was very heavily emphasized, um, as, like, a major part of the game, um, was kind of, like, was kind of, like, it was emphasized really heavy, heavily, but it didn't have a lot of main story, um, implications. 
is, is kind of, I think, the thing that I want to say. Other than that, the temples were interesting, the bosses were interesting, um, the game itself was overall fun. I liked a bunch of the puzzles that they put in here. I like that they did, um, as I called it, 3D thinking with Zelda. So typically when somebody thinks of 3D thinking, they think of like, oh, I exist in this 3D, three-dimensional space. And that's not always how it works. Um, sometimes, sometimes it's fun to include things like, um, and a lot of other Zelda dungeons don't really do this very frequently, especially in the 3D ones, where you have to think spatially about um, the overall level of interactions that you can do with the world that normally you constitute them as negative, but it turns out to not be so. By that I mean we constitute falling in Zelda in, in games like this, these 2D top-downs, um, as being a bad thing because obviously all falling does is damage you. Um, but <clears throat> when you're using it in dungeons, you they give you the idea of like, okay, here's what's down this hole if you're looking down. And it's like, oh, I get it. Um, I, I, like, I like puzzles like that. Um, the kind that make you think with layers, I guess, rather than what would typically be dubbed three-dimensionally. So, overall, not a bad game. Um, B minus, I would say, 7.5 out of 10, maybe an 8 out of 10. Um, it was a nice palate cleanser after the suffering that was uh, Metroid Prime 2. Which, I don't like Metroid games. Um, Prime 2 made me swear off the series. Um, so, this is a good palate cleanser. Generally, I tend to like Zelda games. I try not to show too much bias of them. Overall, um, if you tried to sell me this for 60 bucks back in the day, though, I'd raise an eyebrow at that price. This game is probably worth, in my opinion, uh... About 30 bucks, maybe 40 bucks, if I'm pushing it. Because I got... I, I sat down and from 7.30 until about 11 at night, which means I sat down for about three-ish hours every night I played this. And I finished in half the regular time tonight, so that's 3, 6, 9, and then 11-ish, 12-ish hours to get through this game. You could beat this game, if you did nothing else, in a day. Um, just like Goober said he did. And because of that, you, when you equate your dollar value to the level of fun you have, um, if you told me that across a 12-hour gameplay, um, if I paid 40 bucks for this, that would be like, uh, what is it? Three-ish bucks an hour. Three, six, nine, twelve. Yeah, so like 30... 36. It's it's like a little it's like 350 or something. I don't know, it's weird. If you told me this was three bucks an hour, I'd say, yeah, okay, that's about worth three bucks an hour. If you told me this was worth uh six bucks an hour, I'd just be kind of like, mmm. It's too short. It's too short to be worth the full price of a Zelda game. Um It's half the length, literally half the length. This is the equivalent of if you played Ocarina of Time. And it stopped after the get the three gemstones from the three races. Or if you played Wind Waker and the game ended after you got the three pearls. You know, you went just straight to Ganondorf. Um, it doesn't feel completed. It feels like there's still something missing. And compared to the other 2D top-down Zeldas, um, I would honestly give this game more of a C rating just for the length alone. Um, overall, not bad, but... Definitely not worth what a lot of people will try to charge you for a game like this. Um, would I say this falls into my top five Zelda? No. No. God, no. It's not a bad Zelda, but it's not that good, you know? Like, it's, it's not. It's still better than Skyward Sword, um, but it's not that good, you know? So, that's the end of my thoughts on this. Uh, 
yeah, I think, um, I think that's really it. I think that's all the thoughts I have on this game. I can't really give more thoughts than that because it's too short. I can't give more feedback. I would say this, the one thing I really liked in this game that they did was giving you, like, such a varied perspective in that regard of, um... Your first boss is a regular-sized choo-choo that feels giant because it hops into the temple. Um, or you fight an Octorok with a plant overgrowth that feels giant, but you're really just tiny. Um... And, and I really liked that kind of take on perspective thing of like, oh god, if you were tiny, this is literally just how everything would feel and it would be, it would be terrifying, you know? It's like trying to go at these things with what is a, the equivalent of like a, a metal splinter, you know? But, um, yeah, yeah, so...